one of the experiments that we had performed to see whether or not we could summon something within the forest, it okay. worked. <laughs> okay. We summoned a UFO. We've got the convergence of many things. We've got the advancement of AI. Mm -hmm. We've got the Hadron Collider back to explore different dimensions. We've got disclosure in America. These are massive things all coming together at the same time. Is it coincidence? I think it's no accident, and this might be about people's psychological makeup, I think it's no accident that alien abduction experiences in the recent past actually mirror people who met earth spirits, fairies and things like that centuries ago. I think the whole nuts and bolts thing, mm. and then from another world, is mm. diverting people, it's the elephant in the room, it's diverting people away from what's really going on. I think, because we live in a technological age, mm -hmm. you know, we, we, we call them Mm -hmm. aliens, extraterrestrial craft. A hundred years ago, they had been demons and angels. Um, if uh, another civilization like ours existed uh, billions of years ago, they had much more time to develop their science and technology. And it is possible that they would uh, be able to figure out if there are extra spatial dimensions and take advantage of them uh, using uh, quantum gravity engineers. So a lot of it still looks like magic. So how do particles blip in and out of existence? But we know that, that they do. So is it possible if you had enough of these particles together or something else that's governed by the same principles, has the same components, can it also blip in and out of existence? If you're going to read it from a biblical perspective, you're always going to put it into a demonic kind of category. What I don't understand is, you know, are they, are they covering it up because they don't want to scare? You know, what would be more scary is telling people that angels and demons exist. In a way, if we did get the answers, would that be actually what we want? Think about it, would we? Re we'd probably be changed people, wouldn't we? Is it possible the Americans were testing their own cutting edge drone technology against their own pilots? Simply put, Project Blue Beam is the idea that through a combination of maybe holographic projection technology, Hollywood special effects and government or deep state spin mm. and manipulation you could create a false narrative mm. and the, the two examples that have been given are you could create basically a false flag alien invasion or a false flag second coming this is project blue Beam, the idea that you could fake an alien invasion for example and yeah. and then use it to manipulate populations and and the new world order takes over uh, so maybe what's visiting us is not actually alive it's ai ai future humans <laughs>